you, my dearest daughter, London May. On February 18th, my best friend and my most prized possession was born. You were born on President's Day at 5.43 p.m. You were a teeny, tiny baby. Everyone thought you only weighed five or six pounds, but you were seven pounds, nine ounces, and you were strong. When you were only a few seconds old, you lifted your head and looked at me with your big, dark eyes. They were so be dark and so beautiful. I will never forget the first second I looked at you and realized in that moment, my life would be one big, beautiful adventure. You wrapped your finger over mine, and in that moment, I knew a love I never knew before. I thought I knew what unconditional love was, but I didn't. I now know it's a love that you will never completely understand until you become a parent someday far, far from now. No matter what, I will love you. You could never make a choice that would make me love you any less. You are my daughter, and I will love you for forever. When you were born on President's Day, at first I didn't think much about it. But now I know it only makes sense that a strong-willed, intelligent, leader little lady like yourself was born on President's Day. It wouldn't have seemed right if you were born on any other day. After all, someday you might just be president. My dearest London May, you have changed my life in ways I couldn't have dreamed of. I used to dread the mornings. But now I wake up smiling because I know it's another day that we get to spend together. I know it's another day you get to teach me something new about myself or yourself and a new day I get to watch you grow. Every day since the day you were born, you have taught me something new. From how to change a diaper when you're half awake to how to be grateful just to go outside and see the beautiful world God has made and hear the song of the birds that fly through the skies and feel the sunshine on my face. You are like sunshine warm and bright and leave a warm tingling feeling. It's hard to be in a bad mood when the sunshine is shining on your face. And honey, you're my sunshine. I am smiling constantly when you are with me. The way you see the world, the way you light up when a stranger smiles at you is so beautiful. Wherever you go, you are the life of the party and make so, so many friends and want to be everybody's friend, no matter how old they are, the color of their skin, anything you want to be their friend. You are so timeless and so wonderful. I thank God every day for making me your mommy and for you teaching me more than I could ever teach you. You are fearfully, wonderfully made. You are the most amazing little girl I have ever or will ever meet. You are so cheerful and full of life. You have an amazing sense of humor and you are so funny and always are making me and everyone around you laugh. You never cease to make the day so much fun. There's never a dull moment with you, and I love that about you. You go, go, go from the second you wake up till the second you fall asleep. To my dearest London May, my daughter, my pride and joy, my heart walking outside of my body, thank you for being you and being the sweetest, most vibrant soul. You have made my life better than I could have ever imagined, and you make every person that knows you or has ever seen you even across the screen a better, happier person. You love unconditionally and have the most genuine heart I've ever seen. I want you to always know how incredibly smart you are, how incredibly beautiful you are, and how incredibly strong you are. You are an incredible, and for as long as I live, I will be there for you. Through whatever you go through, I will be there holding your hand. And when a day comes where I can't be there physically to hold your hand, know that I will forever be in your heart and cheering you on. Mommy and Daddy couldn't be more proud of you. You're so amazing, and you're only one year old. We know you will do amazing, amazing things, dearest London May. Never forget, Jesus loves you, and you can do anything you set your mind to. But whatever you end up doing, I know you will glorify God. What if the world had more of your smile? What if the wind could spread your love? What if your sweetness could reach everyone? There'd be no wars mm -hmm. Maybe the birds will sing about your heart Maybe the trees will whisper the word Maybe the sun will 
spread your joy to the ones who lost their hope. for watching the video if you enjoyed please make sure to give it a thumbs up and comment what you thought of it it took a lot of time Brandon and I both were working on it but I love the way it turned out I am so happy that London will always have this and we can show it to her in the future and she can watch it when she's 90 years old that's something I love about YouTube and you guys can all watch it and we are so thankful for all 1,270 of you. <laughs> we love you guys all so much and we are so glad that we get to share our precious London May with you. We are so glad that you get to be there to watch her grow and you get to learn from her because we all have things that we can learn from London and I am just so happy that YouTube is a thing and that we are all able to connect no matter where you are, who you are we are all able to connect on youtube and you are able to watch our videos and we hope we make you smile because you guys all make us smile so much and make london smile and i show her the little edits and she dances to them and she is so so blessed to have all of you guys supporting her and cheering her on and we are so blessed to be her parents and we could not imagine having any other daughter than london she's exceeded all of our expectations she just I knew that being a parent would be so rewarding but yet every day I'm like I cannot believe that she is my daughter and I get to watch her grow and get to be her parent for the rest of my life and I'm just so blessed and so thankful and we just love yeah. you we, London we just, so much yeah we, we love you so much, London, and we just wanted to thank everybody for all the support and everything that you guys give us. It's daily. just insane how many people love London and all I the things us. that they do for her, the edits, the comments, everything yeah, about it. Yeah, and we appreciate it all so yeah. much, and we read all of them, we respond to all of them, and we just wanted to say thank you guys, 
and wanted to say London someday when you're watching this I hope you know that mommy and daddy could not possibly love you more and we think the absolute world of you and you are such an amazing special little girl and we are so proud and honored to be your parents and we love you more than anything we love you London May